All right, guys, uh, what's going on? Um, good morning. I know it's only a little bit, pa a little, a little bit past four in the morning. What we said is where I live. Um, but, um, I don't know what I want to call it, like a podcast type thing or something. But uh, I just kind of want to. Well, before we get into anything, I just want to say uh, thank you for. Um, the lot, the few people that subscribed last night, and then Angel who subscribed, I believe, like maybe sometime earlier yesterday afternoon. So thank you guys, thanks Angel, Splix and Boots, Splix and Boots, uh, subscribed last night um, when we were watching DM Gaming stream when he was streaming the Cavs and the Warriors, and uh, unfortunately the stream got taken down. So sorry that happened to you, DM. Um. I, I know all that licensing crap and all that. Uh, yeah. Um, it kind of ticked me off, too, because I also looked at another channel, and it showed uh, another guy who had even more views than you, and it didn't really make sense. He had, like, 10,000 views on his stream, and his didn't get taken down. So I think, I don't know, it's stupid. But uh, whatever. Anyways, with that out of the way, guys, um, how's your morning going? Today's E3 day, so hope you guys are all excited for E3. Sorry for the bad lighting, too, by the way. I'm recording this in the shed. Um, you guys want to see my key catch? Ugh, sorry, buddy. Interesting thing about this cat is uh, she's actually purring while I do this, which is kind of messed up. But uh, if you look at her foot, she doesn't actually have a back foot right here. She doesn't have a back foot. And then my other cat, Stubbs. Stubbs, come here. Stubbs, come here, buddy. Here, I'll go get her. Stubbs, come here. Okay, I'm going to let her eat for a little while. And then I'll let her come over here. She's got like, baby kittens, so I don't want to bother her while she's trying to eat. Because she probably doesn't get to eat that much anyways. But, um, yeah, she has baby kittens and stuff. I think they're about a few weeks old now, maybe. I'm not entirely sure. But, uh, yeah, she's got baby kittens. We got... Three orders of kittens, and then on top of that, we got another cat is pregnant. Who is pregnant? We have two black cats. Well, one of my black cats, um, which is their their mother's name is Maxie, and she has we call her, I came up with the name Maxie because when she was a kitten, we realized that she had more paws than her mom because her mom had extra paws. Her mom's name was Tink, by the way, but Tink passed away in 2015. Um, I think she was like three or four when she died, but um. So she wasn't an old cat, she was a fairly young cat. But, uh, yeah, Tink was a very loving cat. I love Tink. We got her in, like, I got her for my birthday in 2012, so I was probably about 14. And I was probably about 7, I think I was almost 17 when she died. So, yeah, she was a good cat. I think she got bit eight by coyotes or something, because I live in Minnesota and crap like that happens. I also had a really pretty cat named Skittles that I got in 2014. She was a calico cat. And, um... She, uh, she got ripped up by a stupid, um, bucks, bucks were out in the crop field and they ripped her apart, so that kind of sucks. But, uh, I'm gonna go get Stubbs. Stubbs, come here, buddy. Come here. You know what? I'm gonna go get her. She's just sitting here right now. I'm gonna get her. Oh, Stubbs, come here. Oh, that's not quite hard to get. Stubbs, come here. She wants to show off her babies. Oh, come here, buddy. You're gonna be famous. So, if you look at this one, you'll notice that, uh, well, hey, don't, come on, don't scratch, don't scratch. I just want to show them. Hey, I have to show them somehow. Come on. Hey, 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 don't scratch. Don't scratch. Hey, right, so if you'll notice that she has no back feet. So, if you guys are wondering the backstory to this, you guys are wondering the backstory to this. Basically, she was actually born last May. Yeah, I know my cats breed fast, but uh, yeah, she was born last May, and um, what happened was her mother had her under the under a deck, and um, when she had the kittens under the deck, what happened was they were got tangled up in like some vine or something under the deck. Well, basically, my mom had to, like surgically remove the freaking um vining and stuff because it, it was really bad i mean if it wasn't if she didn't save them they probably would have every kitten in that litter probably would have lost its feet 
that's how bad it was because she was she just lucky enough to where, you know, it was tight around some of them. So, if, like I said, those two lost their feet. Well, the one lost her back foot, but the other, the other girl completely lost her two back feet. That's that's why we call her stubs. And then the other one, I call her hoppers because she just has the one missing foot. So I'm a lot of suggested wheels and stuff, but um, I'm very confident in these guys that they know how to get around. I mean, they have kittens for crying out loud. They've been taking care of their kittens. They have, have had no issues or anything. So I'm very confident in them. I think they're really, I don't think they're going to be able to live past their handicap and have long lives. I really think that they're going to be fine. It's just, yeah. Um, so, yeah. And then, so the one that I showed you guys earlier that has the one foot missing, she's drinking the water right now. And then, so yeah. Uh, well, that's that. That's that situation. And, uh, let's see here. So, yeah, E3 today. Um, so that'll be fun. By the way, guys, I am going to, if you watch this video, I am going to be watching on DM stream. So, like, for some of my subscribers that don't actually watch DM and they want to chat with me about E3, because he's actually going to be having full coverage of the E3, or at least he said he, he said he is, but um, if he actually does, I'll make a quick little short video clip later on, I think, I don't know what time E3 starts, but whatever, whenever, I don't know, whenever he goes live, I'll make a video, so for some of my subs out there, like, because I know there's a few of you out there that don't know that I'm, I kind of talk to DM a lot, but uh, yeah, for those of you guys that don't know, I, there's this really cool Madden content creator. His name is DM, and I've been watching him for like maybe I don't want to say a month, maybe a few weeks. I don't I don't I don't know when I started watching him exactly. It was sometime in May, but yeah. So he makes some awesome Madden content. He's probably one of the best Madden content creators out there, if not the best, because he he posts daily Madden news. Like yeah, there are the other big YouTubers out there. But the point I want to get across is all those, all they do is talk about Madden Ultimate Team. He doesn't sit there and whine about Madden Ultimate Team every 10 seconds. That's why I like him, because he actually plays franchise mode and things that I enjoy. And plus, he likes Draft Champions, so I'm cool with that, because Draft Champions, in my opinion, is the only mode in online that is a good alternative to play, because you don't have to do microtransactions. You don't have to buy stuff. You just get to work for it, and that's cool. And it's rewarding, too, because if you draft right, you get the right players right away, and you don't have to pay for it. So, yeah, that's pretty much all. That's my point. I want to get across the ultimate team. I don't want to get, get into a rant. I'm just saying I like draft champions more. I also wish that for Madden 18, they could do like some sort of draft presentation for ultimate team. Now, I know a lot of people probably wouldn't care for that because, like, you know, if they're playing with their friends... My stomach just growled, but if you're playing with your friends, um, you know, obviously you want to just, you want to get the draft over. And yeah, I could see that. Like, let's see, you could skip the presentation, but me, I play with a bunch of randoms all the time, so I wouldn't even care because the only time I ever played with anybody on PS4 that wasn't a random was my brother, but the dummy broke his PS4, so unless he gets another PS4, we can't play together, and I really don't want to get an Xbox One anytime soon, because, man, it's crazy how much the price has dropped from the PS4, because when I bought my PS4, about like, two years ago, it was, like, what, $350? No, I knew it almost been $400, so, man, that's, that's crazy how quick the price drops in just two years' time. But anyways, yeah, this is just a short little vlog video, and, um, so, yeah, go subscribe to DM Gaming, um, if you get, look under my subscriptions, which I think you should be able to, but I'm not entirely sure. But if you do go into my channel and you do see my subscription box or whatever, you should see DM Gaming if you keep scrolling. Because he's not too... He's actually at the beginning of the list, kind of. So, um, yeah, that's who I'll be watching. So if you guys want to chat with me live, um, you can go over to his channel and you can you guys can talk to me if you want. So, yeah. Um... Anyways, with that out of the way, guys, this is Alex. I'm out. Uh, if I see you guys later in his stream, that would be great. So that's DM Gaming. So that's D and M. And I know there's a lot of DM Gamings out there, so um, 
because I've seen actually people that have the same name, but uh, the way you know it's him is that he actually has a thousand subscribers, which none of the other DMs do. They're just like stupid little kids. I'm not trying to be mean, it's just they're little kids, you know. So, um, yeah, uh, they go. So, uh, yeah, he's the real DM Gaming, so I just want to get that out of the way. If you're looking for his channel, so, um, anyways, I'll see you guys in later on today. Hopefully, talk about E3, talk, cover some of the stuff. Um, yeah, see you guys later. Peace.